Home to perhaps the loudest fans in the NFL, Century League Field is the site for this AFC West versus NFC West matchup between the Broncos and the Seahawks. Well, when you talk about Seattle Seahawks, Denver Broncos, you know the one thing I, I think about Seattle, Pete Carroll's done an awesome job. Slowly build that team up where, you know, he's not building the West Coast team. He's trying to be big, tough, and physical, and so far it's working pretty well. How do you think this game comes down in the end? Well, you, these two teams, are, they're built really the same way. They want, they want to out-hit you. Uh, so when you talk about that is the main focus of what you're trying to do. In the game that means what it's not gonna be a lot of scoring so I think it'll be a low scoring game And Rice is in the slot. Wilson's got it in the gun. Russell Wilson out to Sidney Rice. He's in the clear. The 30, the 20, the 10. Going to take it home for the touchdown. Even on short passes, accuracy is a big, big deal. When you put it on them right in stride, look what happens. They catch it in stride. They don't slow down, of course. And... Good things happen. Nice touchdown run. Seahawks ready here for the kickoff. And they crash into him, ending the return at the 20-yard line. Moreno lined up in the backfield. Moreno's handed the football. The NFL is about situations. A good job by the runner knowing where the first down was. Gets it there and he moves those chains. They're able to move the chains after that last run. Moreno's got it on the handoff. He'll be taken down about three yards short of the first. And that's the type of run I think this offense would take all game long, Phil. Oh, would they ever. They would love this. This is, this is showing your dominance here. The offensive line doing a good job, but also a solid job by the running back picking up some good yards. Dreesen's a receiver all the way out to the right. Second and three. Here's the quick toss. They bring him to the turf. Nice job that time by the ball carrier. Getting it just past the first down mark. Big first down. Keep the chains moving. After picking up the first on the ground, balls called on once again. Power running. A lot of teams in this league don't even do it anymore. This team, they can power it up in there and pick up those tough yards. Peyton Manning under center. Second down and five. Play fake here, looking to the right side and throwing. Games 16. Well, if you want to be a good play action pass team, it's always nice to have a good running game. Make the defense dig in and try to stop your run. 
when they do that, you fool them. You fake it, you throw it down the field. That That's that's about as easy as it gets. Got to give the defense some credit. On first down, there's so many things the offense can do. They were ready for that play, and they stopped it. Dreesen's on the right side, split out wide, and he's able to get out to the 34-yard line. You got to keep your offensive lineman aggressive, so you have to run the football every once in a while. That run, even though it was a short gain, it served a purpose. Deckers lined up now as a slot receiver. Third and ten. He'll fire it out to the left. Always aware of the chains. He's got the catch, and he's got the first. You just can't sit back there and play conservative defense in the NFL. The quarterbacks and receivers are too good. Third and over 10 yards, you play safe, and you give up the first down. This will be the eighth play of this drive. First down and 10. Thomas gonna pull in. Denver, touchdown. Good job by the offense. They get in there, they tie this game up. Now we'll see if the defense can take advantage of that momentum and keep it on their side. Got a flag. He made it. Offside. The penalty is declined. That last play will hold up. The Seahawks are in shape now to return the kick. The Seahawks in the pistol. Wilson's going to take it from the gun. It's Bailey with the pick. That was a terrible throw by the quarterback. When you're off target like that, you deserve to throw an interception. is lined up in the slot. First and ten. Moreno's going to secure the handoff. They pounce on him there. Well, a short gain on the run that time by the offense. When you're running football team, listen, there's going to be a lot of ugly plays that don't work. You just got to keep running it. Moreno's taking the handoff. He's headed right. It's Earl Thomas who makes the tackle. a receiver in the slot they'll go shotgun here he's looking to the right here on this throw this Broncos in for the score good job on that touchdown that puts them ahead and it's always of course better to be ahead than behind the Broncos for the point after the point after is good. Matt Prater is ready to run up and kick this football. Jukes around the defender.
Setting up in the pistol on this play. Russell Wilson will take it from the gun. Right where it had to be. Well, I think we've heard this expression about 7,000 times. It's a passing league, so we all know that. So you got to be able to throw the football and pick up some first downs. Going across the middle, off the mark. I don't know what was more terrible. That was a terrible route, terrible throw by the quarterback. Oh, and what a shock. It's incomplete. Lynch is lined up directly behind the quarterback here. Looking for a receiver on the left side here. And it's incomplete. Just couldn't hold on to it after the hit. Does it take town to do something like this? You've got a time to pass where the football's going, where the receiver's going to catch it and do the perfect timing. Hit that receiver and that football comes flying out. Nice job that time. Incomplete pass. The offense now needs to pick up the first here on third down after that incompletion. Looking for an open receiver on the right. Russell Wilson out to Sidney Rice. Perfect defense call that time. They allowed the catch. The coach on the sidelines going, well, what else do you want me to do? We had the guy double covered, and you still couldn't make the play. Lined up in the pistol formation. The wide receiver shifting around in motion. Wilson still has it after some nifty play action. Percy Harvin with the grab. Quarterbacks love play action passes because the defense, sometimes they're expecting run. You fake it, easy completion down the field. Let's see how they back up the big play here. Here's the handoff to Marshawn Lynch. Gains 19. Nice run that time by the running back, and if they keep running the football like this, it's just a matter of time before they fake it and throw that football over the top of the defense. They are being physical, the running back doing a good job, and they are making it happen in the running game today. The Seahawks on offense here to start the second quarter. down here after the run and the second quarter is underway with this snap as much as these guys practice during the offseason training camp during the week you think receivers and quarterbacks would always be on the same page that time they were not and it's another incomplete pass second down after the incompletion action fake what a hit, and the ball falls incomplete. That's interesting. As you watch the receiver trying to make that catch, he knew the defender was close, so he didn't put all of his heart into it. The defender made a nice hit and knocks the football out to the ground. Hey, hey. On, Offense lines up here. Third and goal at the six. Well, that score ties the game up. Now, on the defensive side, you've got to come out there and take advantage of this, this feeling you got going now and get the football back for your offense. The point after try is in the books. The Broncos back deep, ready to receive. Got the hand up into the sky, and that means fair catch. lined up outside on the right first and ten wasting no time here's the toss to the outside 
lot of ways to get plays in the NFL. It doesn't always have to be by a pass. Good job that time by the running back. come back to the line after picking up over 20 yards on that last play. First and 10, they'll run it off the toss. He's brought to a halt. Safeties now in the NFL have to cover like a corner, and they got to tackle like a linebacker. And that time the safety came up, and he tackled like a linebacker and stopped that outside run. Dreesen's the receiver all the way to the right side. Quarterback drops back, play action. He wants to go deep. The catch in the books. Touchdown. Well, it was a long throw and catch by the quarterback and receiver, but that was absolutely awful coverage by the defense. They were out of position, and they give up the long touchdown throw. The Seahawks are set to return to kickoff. He had nowhere to go, and they deck him at the 16-yard line. Sean Lynch is in the backfield on the money able to take the football out to the 28 yard line when a quarterback can run he usually takes one guy out of pass coverage look at the spy that time on the quarterback that opens up the passing lanes good throw and catch throws to the right it's Bailey with the pick nice tackle that was an awesome job by the defense they just made with the quarterback size they got in position and they made the interception. Dreesen split out wide on the right. Moreno's going to take the handoff now. Good job that time by the offense. Power run gets him a few yards. Second and one, the quarterback will hand it off. Advances it out to about the nine. That's a nice job blocking by the offensive line and a really good job by the running back. Seeing the proper hole, gets up in there and picks up big yards. able to move the chains after that last run. Quarterback flips it to the running back. Ron goes in the end zone. I would bet first and goal that the offense about 90% of the time is going to run the football. And what do they do here? They run it, and they get it done. That is power football at its best. Broncos ready to boot it down the field. Makes 
makes the move and gets around the defender. The Seahawks will go with the pistol on this play. First and ten. Looking for Percy Harvin. Incomplete, almost intercepted. Well, for some reason, this quarterback likes to keep trying to go deep down the field against this cover, too. That's not the spot you want to go. You want to look underneath or right down the middle. Offense lines up here. Second down and ten. Percy Harvin with the grab. Sometimes they tell the receiver just to go long, run a fly route, run a nine route, because that means straight ahead or a streak. Show the speed that you had and get it done. Now they take the football onto the opponent's side of the field. That time the pass is completed into double coverage, Jim, but the quarterback made a bad read, but these receivers, they are so good nowadays. That time, in double coverage, he went up and made the catch. It's like Bill Parcells said to me once about Mark Navarro, a very talented receiver. He goes, remember, Sims, when he's covered, he's open. And Rice is going to get set in the slot for this snap. The wide receiver in motion. Looking for Percy Harvin. Almost intercepted. Well, they go for the bomb, but the defensive backfield was not fooled. Yeah, they were all over at that time, and they just that was like shadow defense. Wherever the receiver was going, the defense was right next to him. Great job. Lynch is lined up now as the running back behind the quarterback. Third down and five. Under pressure and incomplete. Russell Wilson has his man. It's Percy Harvin on the receiving end. Well, when you get a couple first downs on a drive, it just, of course, it makes you feel good about what you're doing. It loosens up the offensive play caller, and there's nothing like dictating to the defense. Love it. Incomplete as that ball sails out of bounds. And Rice is in the slot. Second and ten. Play action fake. Looking to throw. A takeaway. Breaks the tackle. Good piece of tackling. Good job that time by the defense. Not being fooled. Being in position. When you're in position, you have a chance to make the play. That time they did, they got the interception. <laughs> Offense lines up here. First and ten. 
trying to get it outside before the defense is set. That'll stop the play right there. When you're an offensive lineman and you can line up and just run the football straight ahead and pick up those kind of yards, you are going to get into the head of the defense. You're basically saying we're tougher than you are and we're just going to come right at you. Play action. Going deep. Looking for Demarius Thomas. And intercepted. I have to say, that's just a terrible decision by the quarterback there. He's got to know when you're in a situation like this, you just cannot make that type of pass. The Seahawks will approach this play from out of the pistol. Heading right. Tackle down at the 42-yard line. What a good job by the defensive player there. Just flushing the running back and driving him into the ground. Wilson standing back in the shotgun ready for the snap. Going for the deep ball. But they can't connect. Deep passes in the NFL, they always serve a purpose. You're not always going to get the completion, but at least it gets the defense thinking that you will try some long throws down the field. It'll be third down. Gonna drop back. Russell Wilson has his man. It's Percy Harvin on the receiving end. Jim Nance, that was the old fly route. When we were kids, that's what they called it. See if you can fly by the defensive back. He did that time. Nice throw and catch. Here's the first snap after the big play. Sidney Rice with the reception. Well, even though they're down more than seven here, the offense down the red zone, it'll be good for them for the rest of this game, their confidence uh, for the offensive coach that they can punch this in for the touchdown. After the long game, let's see what they do here. And he's going to pitch it here. Touchdown. This game is tight. you got to give the offensive line just a lot of credit. It's first and goal. They just line up and power the football in there. Nice run, but a great job by the old line. The Seahawks now lined up for the extra point. Challenging the defense. Got the touchdown. Got the two-point conversion. People love to go for two in this game, don't they? Well, they do, and you know what? Now, I guess you and I just can't sit here and blast the coach for a bad decision. When you pick up the two points, you can't complain about what they're trying to do. Signal for fair catch. Lined up now as a slot receiver. Now first and ten. Looks to his left. Manning complete as he finds Welker on that throw. How do you stop these receivers now? It's almost impossible with the rules of the game. Uh, tight coverage. That time they have double coverage on him. It doesn't matter. The throw comes. They go up. They make the catch. All you can do is raise your arm and go, well, we did our best. Deckers lined up in the slot. First and ten. Trying to work that left side. That catch will extend the drive. Every quarterback in the NFL loves this coverage where you got four defensive backs all playing deep. So in routes, anything across the middle, usually it's wide open. Good job of the quarterback taking advantage of the defense that time.
Peyton Manning under center. First and ten. He gets the toss. They tackle him for a loss. Good job by the defense. They stopped the offense that time on first down. Now the defense is in a good situation. From 40 yards. The field goal try. Yes, sir. So that's going to do it for the first half. Broncos are up in this one. We're back here now in this one, where the Broncos are leading by nine. A check to the sidelines with Danielle Bellini reporting. I caught up with Coach Fox during halftime. Jim, with the lead here at the half, he was feeling good about how things had gone to this point. He said, I think we're doing a good job repeating what we did in practice. We've come out and look confident in what we're doing, and it shows on this scoreboard. Now they've just got to do it for another half, guys. Back to you. Danielle, thank you very much. Now we'll go to the field. Moreno's lined up as the single back. And now here's the first snap of the second half. Gains maybe five. When you have a defense, it's not playing good techniques. They're selling out, overplaying plays while you run the counter runs to counteract what they're doing on the defensive side. Moreno lined up in the backfield. Moreno's handed the football. How about the defensive line? Getting that penetration, getting off the football at the snap, and getting it done, getting in the backfield and making that tackle. Deckers, a receiver in the slot. Third and eight. And they bring down the quarterback, and it's a three and out for the offense. This defense you're playing against, they're pretty good. So it's fourth down near midfield, punt the football. Manning's back in shotgun formation. And they'll turn it over on downs. The defense does a fantastic job holding strong. Lines up here. First and ten. Marshawn Lynch takes the football. In on the stop. When you run the football like this and you show toughness, there is no doubt. When you fake it and try to throw the football down the field, the quarterback's going to have all day to get it done. Percy Harvin with the grab. This doesn't look good. We've got a player down and he's in pain. I think you can just tell by the body language and the way he's acting, that is an upper body injury. Hope it's not severe. We'll let you know as soon as we find out. Two tight ends on the field here. Wilson from the shotgun throws the pass. Perfectly thrown. Touchdown and drawing close. Nowadays, so many kids, they grow up, they want to be wide receivers. I don't blame them. They're out there, they get to catch the football, they get to score touchdowns, they get to do dances, and you're not really allowed to hit them either. What a job. Lining up now for the two. He'll fire it out to the left. So they give up the touchdown, but they do not allow the two-point play. Yeah, good job that time of the defense. So quick and so ready for that play. They reacted very fast. That's why they stopped it. Yeah. 
Here's the kick, and this one's just a little squib kick. And he is tackled at the 44. Let's get the injury report from Danielle Bellini. Guys, I just spoke with a Seahawks official. Percy Harvin's injury seems to be relatively minor, or at least it's minor enough that he'll be back on the field shortly. Dreesen's a receiver all the way out to the right. First and 10. Here's the quick toss to the running back. Bringing the play to an end. It's now second down and seven after the three yard rush. Tosses it to the running back. Gain of 18. That's what you want to do. Just get a first down, especially when you're on top. Keep the clock moving. Keep the defense guessing. Make them react instead of attack. Peyton Manning under center. and 10. Ball is snapped and the quarterback tosses it to the outside. Tackles made. Nice situation here for the offense. They're winning the football game. Now they're in the red zone. Let's see if they can come up with a play that fools the defense. Here they come back to the line after picking up over 20 yards on that last play. and 10. Back to the ground, and that's a big tackle behind the line of scrimmage. Good job by the defense. They stopped the first down play that time by the offense, and now they have a good situation. Try over again on second down. Manning's play action. Makes the catch. Touchdown. Five receivers, they are turned into stars in the NFL. And you know why? Because they can make catches like this. What a great catch. The Broncos lined up now for the point after. And the extra point is good. The Seahawks are in shape now to return the kick. And he's tackled just past the 20. We'll mark it at the 22-yard line. First down here. Wilson's going to take the snap from the shotgun. Gets away from the pressure, and he's forced to the ground. Well, if your offensive line's not good enough just to stop the pass rush, then you got to help him out. How do you do that? Well, you keep the tight end in, let him be an extra blocker, and you tell your running backs to help out, too, blocking some of these defensive linemen. Here comes the wide receiver in motion. Working that left side. Russell Wilson has his man. It's Percy Harvin on the receiving end. Nice catch by the receiver, but it still doesn't get a first down. Rice is going to get set in the slot for this snap. 
looking to the right side and throwing. What a catch! And now we'll be on the other side of the 50 after this play. When you pick up first downs against the defense, they will get tired. That time, nice job by the offense getting the first down, even though they're losing here in the game. From the shotgun. Eyeing that left side. Very nearly intercepted. This is frustrating for a coach. You call a play, you get the receiver down the field on a quarter route, and your quarterback cannot put it on the target. We'll have one more play before the quarter expires. Second down and 10. Looking at every option. Escaping the pressure. Throwing now to his left. Unbelievable catch. And that's going to do it for the third quarter. We'll be back to the beautiful skyline of Seattle for the start of the fourth after the break. was a big gainer. Now it's time to back it up. Running to the right. Touchdown. Now close the gap. Good job by the offensive coordinator. Calling those plays. Leads to a touchdown. They're just slowly chipping away at this lead. Now can the defense come out and help them out? The Seahawks with the PAT to come. Count it. They're lining up here for the onside kick. That kick came right at him, and it looks like the receiving team has recovered. Center. First and ten. Handoff up the middle. And he's taken down at the 36, but that's enough for the first down. Well, the defensive coach is going to be upset after this play. After that long run, terrible angles, and really just a lack of hustle by the defense gives up the long run. New set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground. Balls got it on the handoff. And here he goes. Jim, the offensive coordinator, has done a terrific job so far here today. He's got his team winning. They're in the red zone. Let's see how clever he's going to be on this call. First down, following the long play. And they go back to the ground. He's brought down. It's getting harder and harder in the NFL to score when you're this close to the goal line. So what will the offense do? They, they better be creative. That's all I know. Now, second down. They motion the receiver around to the other side. Flip to the outside. Runs it across. Touchdown. Well, there's an old saying in the NFL, you know how many points you need? And the answer is more. 
So no matter what the lead is, keep trying to score. Nice job by the offense getting that extra touchdown. Extra point is good. Matt Prater is ready to run up and kick this football. And they're all over him at the 18-yard line. Double tight end formation. First and ten. Stands in the pocket. Complete. Well, he had all day long to throw the football that time. That's why he had success throwing the football down the field. I'll tell you what, this defense, they need to start blitzing this quarterback. Lynch is in the backfield. Single back set. Looking to go up top again on first down. The throw to the left. Caught 36 yard gain. So anytime you're in the red zone, you want to punch it in and get that touchdown. If they do that, look, they still they're still going to be behind, but it gives them confidence moving forward. That long gain sets them up here on this play. No room to complete that one. Jim, when you get inside the other team's red zone, inside the 20-yard line, and you're down some points, you're thinking touchdown in these situations. Russell Wilson has it under center. Wilson's got it in the gun. He's looking to the right here on this throw. Ball comes out, and the recovery is made by the defense. That's what you call a takeaway. The defense just makes such a hard hit that they take the football away from the offense, and they recover the fumble. Official stop play now. They want to take another look at that last play. I think when you look at these plays, most of the time it's pretty easy to determine. Uh, Jim, you know, you can freeze that shot and determine if it's a fumble or down by contact. Ready to make the stop on the goal line, loading up that defensive front. No margin for error from just outside the goal line. Good job by the defense. They are all over the throw by the quarterback. They all just pick it off of the end zone. So that's a big opportunity missed when you drop a pass like that. Defense ready in the goal line formation on this one. Second and goal at the two. Running it like it's an option play. Touchdown. And this game just got a whole lot more interesting. What a good job by the offense driving down and getting that touchdown. Even though they're still behind, they're chipping away at this lead, keeping the pressure on their opponents. up now for the two-point conversion. So they convert it here on the two-point drop. Steven Hauschka ready for the kickoff. They're not going to risk the big return, so here's the squib kick. And he's brought down right at the 42.
leading and with possession of the football, a good place to be at this point in the game. First and ten, Manning still got the football after the play fake. Oh, we've got an injured player on the field. That's a good job. He's able to get up and get off the field, and my guess is he's going to be okay. A little bit of a scare there, no doubt about it. That makes everybody nervous. The defense needs a big stop here in order to give the offense a chance as we're running low on time in this one. First and goal. Eye formation and a running play. The defense has got to be a little aggressive here. Your team is down. You've got to attack this offense. You don't want them to get in there and get another score. enough to squeeze in one more play before the two-minute warning here in the fourth. He runs it across for the touchdown. The Broncos with an extra point try on the way. Makes the PAT. The Seahawks are set to return the kickoff. the play to an end. And Rice is in the slot. And he's going to be brought down. Every defense is looking for somebody to hit the quarterback, and the best person to do it is the defensive end. What a good job that time by him. Wilson's going to take it from the gun. He'll fire it out to the left. Russell Wilson out to Sidney Rice. There has been good pass protection for the quarterback all day long. He has not been sacked much, and he throws it there and gets another completion. Quarters formation here for the defense. Three-step drop. Ball's incomplete. Fourth down coming up. Looks like we'll go three and out on this series. Well, they always say if you get your hands on the football, you got to make the catch. Yeah, right. The guy that made that rule up wasn't getting hit as he was trying to catch the football. Nice hit that time by the defender. The Broncos come out in the nickel. Looking for a receiver on the left side here. Makes the tackle after a pickup of 15. Uh, there's nothing the defense can do. When you talk about a receiver like these guys out there now, and, and this one in particular, the double coverage, they're still able to go in between the defenders, rise up, and make the catch. Intercepted, which should all but wrap up this game. What a terrible job by the quarterback. So nobody's open, tries to force the pass, and look, what's it turn into? An interception.
Greasons on the right side. Split out wide. First and ten. Here's the handoff, and they'll run it. And the tackle is made right around the 39-yard line. Outside runs take time. And when you run outside, you expect the safety to get up there with that extra time and make the tackle. Good job that time by the safety. Second down now. Reaction. Manning uncorks a long pass. And it's incomplete. What a good job by the defensive back that time. That ball was thrown beautifully down the field. High arcing throw, but the defensive back in great position knocks it down. The offense needs nine here on third down after that incompletion. Third and nine is the call. The Broncos get a first down, and they advance the ball onto the other side of the field. Well, it doesn't look like much, but it really serves the purpose. Picks up the first down, and now they have a chance to open things up. Caldwell is lined up now as a slot receiver. Manning from the gun. It's over to Welker, under fire on that throw. up in the slot. Second and ten. Looking for an open receiver on the right. That's a nice job by the offense there. Get the first down. Keep those chains moving. Give yourself three more opportunities. First down here after the completion. Peyton Manning from the shotgun. Throws to the right. Pass is made and it's incomplete. The hit jars the ball out. Welkers, a receiver in the slot. Out of the shotgun formation. He had no time to get set. <laughs> Thomas a tight end, but lined up in the backfield for this play. down and 10. It's over to Welker. That catch gives them a first down. The tackle's going to be made, but he's beyond the first down marker. Nice situation here for the offense. They're winning the football game. Now they're in the red zone. Let's see if they come up with a play that fools the defense. About to snap it for the ninth play of the drive. Manning standing back in the shotgun, ready for the snap. It's incomplete. The defender had it for a moment, but could not pick it off cleanly.
breaking huddle at the 20. That is play number 10 on this drive. Second and 10. Challenging the defenders to the right side. Oh, bad decision that time by the quarterback. He tries to force the football into the end zone and it almost gets picked off by the defense. Phil, before we go, how about a little chat about how much this win means? 